I'm Dave, and this is me reacting to some of the best and worst Airbnbs I can find online. Oh, that looks like one of those observatories that you see on top of the mountains in like Mexico or something. It is cool. The view's amazing. The window area is like bendy plastic. I don't know what the name of that is, but it looks like the top bit is like padded with something. So, I mean, obviously you're thinking about heat. That looks like it's padded, maybe insulated. Okay, so it literally is a big dome with just a bed in it and then a table and chairs. So, unless we're seeing it from a different angle where there's a kitchen and bathroom in here. No, just <laughs> nothing else. Uh, yeah, I mean, it's cool and all, but what do you do when you need a piss in the middle of the night? This can't be the only bit of it. Surely there has to be, there's no bathroom in that pod or outside and it's sort of set down a big cliff. You wouldn't want to go out wandering after a few drinks looking for the toilet and just fall down the cliff. And there is a shower and bathroom around the back. Okay, it's gone up my estimations now. Yeah, the view is good. It's a cool spot. The views are good. It's obviously you're coming as a, as a, as a couple to get away. There's no way you're bringing kids to this. You'd be chucking them out over that balcony. Don't know how you're supposed to cook breakfast. Oh, it's in Romania. Uh, <laughs> 54 quid a night. Look, can't argue with 54 quid a night. In terms of the view, 10 out of 10. In terms of the dome itself, yeah, probably an 8 or 8 or a 9 out of 10. It looks good. It's got a shower there. Overall, I give it a 7 out of 10. You have to go to Romania first. If you've ever stayed in any shithole Airbnbs, send me the link and I'll do a review.